Hey, what's up my YouTube family? Okay guys, we got some things we need to talk about. I know I'm checking in late because I work today. Y'all know I was at work. Had a lot going on at work, guys. So I want to come home and um, talk to y'all about the message that Melody's cousin put up. I'm going to put it up here so y'all can see it. And I'm going to also talk about it. She states that Melody and Stormy met in the DMs. I didn't know, wasn't aware of it. But, I mean, a lot of people meet, meet in the DMs and they develop a relationship. So, it is what it is. So, um, she says that Melody gets her numbers changed quite often, you know, um, for whatever reason, she's getting her number changed quite often. And that's her prerogative. She can do what she want to do with her number. But she says that they all know how to uh, get in contact with her. And um, she ended up getting her number after she messaged or whatever. You know, so that's perfectly fine. But my thing is, I was speaking on my life and how I handle things for something that was brought up in a TV show. And I, and I said, this is how I handle it. I think everybody in the world handle things the way that they want to handle it, you know. So, I'm not sure exactly, you know, what what was the whole thing with this, you know. Uh, or maybe she heard a lot that are uh, referring to this comment. And I know I said something on my review referring to this comment. I don't shy away from controversy. I think you guys know that about me. Mm-hmm. It's okay. It's all good. But what I do want to say is I'm entitled to handle things the way I want to handle them. And I said in my life, just like everybody that's watching right now, they can handle it, handle what they want to handle the way they want to handle it in their life. Everybody can. I ain't mad at nobody for the way they handle stuff. That's their business. And, and, and I hope ain't nobody mad at me because the way I want to handle stuff in my life, that's my business. But when I say what I say, and I said what I said, and, you know, it's just, it just is what it is, guys. You know, I know uh, these reviews of this particular show, I don't know, it has legs, uh, mouth, ears, all kind of stuff, and, it, it, and it's like a human being person when people do reviews on this particular show. You know, and I just don't understand why. It's just like any other show. You know, we're, we're here to talk about it. We're here to talk about everybody that's on the show. You know, if you're going to be fair, be fair. So, anywho, that's all I got to say about that. Put the message up here for y'all so y'all can read it in detail. But I just broke it down in who knew terms of how I felt about, you know, when I synced it and when I um, did my review period. Nothing big. We're going to move on from that. And we are going to uh, talk about Martell because guys, they are still back and forth in this uh, court stuff. And Love and Marriage Huntsville released a little clip, guys. It wasn't on the show. So I want to play it for y'all and I want to talk about it a little bit. And I want y'all to tell me what y'all think about this with Hotel Holt. So without any further ado, guys, I'm going to play it and we're going to talk about it. We went to court and, um, <clears throat> you know, I asked for us to have a mediation. And I just asked for six simple things. Like, no man watching the kids. And if you fly to town, make sure you call me before you call any other thing. So give me first right, you know. And I'm gonna do the same thing. At least you can call and you be willing to watch your kids. Right. You got a lot of dads out here don't care about, don't care about the kids. Right. Oh, mm -mm. You know, if I was that type of father, then she'll be trying to hop, chase me down. Then if I was a dad that wasn't here, then she try to chase me down. You know, but she just said basically no, and she said she won't pull that. She ain't gonna cut the difference. I'm not no, because I asked her for a test because I didn't like some of the things that she was doing. That's what prompted her to say now she won't pull a test. So we have go to trial. What? Right. With them y'all's kids, y'all should be able to work some out. All right. Because, you know, to have somebody tell you how to do it with your kids, I wouldn't tell nobody. It's horrible. It's awful. I'm trying to talk to her, like, like let's come to an agreement. She don't even want to do it. I'm like, why not? Why do we need to go and spend $40,000, $50,000? You know what I'm saying? My attorney said we get that, that 10000 bill for, for 20-some days. I got mad at him. <laughs> 20-some days. When we're in court, 
I said that I would much rather go to mediation so we can go ahead and resolve this instead of going to trial and things of that nature. Because to me, it's all unnecessary. Millie and her attorney objected to that, uh, but the judge granted it to us and whatnot. So, you know, I paid for mediation. I sent over my request um, to Melody and her attorney. They stayed on it for about 30, 40 minutes to only send back, you know, a request of, she doesn't want full custody. I'm like, what? So I see there was no compromise. And so I told my attorney, we're not going back and forth. What did y'all think about that? I want to know. Drop down in these comments and let me know. You know, Martell said that um, he had six things that he wanted to be done for them to agree on. Mel didn't agree on it. So she said that she want full custody and they can go to trial. So, guys, I was like, whoa. But I've been told y'all, I think that Mel should have full custody. We already talked about this a couple videos ago. And I've said it in more videos than one. If you guys watch uh, my channel all the time, y'all know I did. So that's not going to change. You know, I do feel like she's the uh, the better parent for the children. And, you know, Martell, he can come, you know, get them through the uh, week if they... um. Agree and or and you know, he can have the weekend, you know, or whatever the weekends, you know, summer break, winter break, you know, whatever, something like that. But primary custody, in my opinion, should have been to Melody. So that's just that. What do you guys think about this? You know, Martel said he just walked out. Yeah. And I was like, well, OK, but you the one started all of this. You took her to court, but now you gonna walk out? I'm through. Mm -mm. I can't, I cannot with Hotel Hope. So anyway, guys, I want to know what y'all think about this. Um, I want to talk about it in these comments. I'm gonna catch y'all on the next video because I do got another video to do. Um, that got to do with Tasha from Escape. Um, and her, the sad chick of her husband, Rocky, uh, some back paddling being going on, some music being put out, y'all, and we need to talk about it, okay? So, make sure y'all watching my channel for my next video that I'm getting ready to upload, and make sure y'all run over to my couple's channel, subscribe, make sure, make sure, make sure y'all check out my lip gloss, my who new lip gloss. So with all that being said, please have a wonderful day, guys. The wonderful rest of your day. And I'm going to catch you in the next video. Deuces.